Okay, let's let's start this. to start and obviously this is the uh, first video that I ever made like this and what I want to talk about today is uh, tomorrow hopefully this is the last time laying here in a hospital. Tomorrow, as I see it, is a new beginning. Why? That's the question. And the answer for that is tomorrow I'll have my third spine surgery, ninth surgery overall. And hopefully everything will go well. say that I'm scared of the surgery I'm more scared of being uh, of staying like this if you don't know who I am I'm uh, Mislav Mironovic I was a professional mountain bike athlete and uh, I was riding for 15 years professionally from 15 years old until um, when I was 30 and in those 15 years I had a lot of crashes a lot of injuries but the biggest one the most serious one was uh, actually at the end of my career when I crashed on my back and the compression of the impact destroyed my my disc and today, since it's my last day being injured like this, and tomorrow I'm going to the hospital uh, to face the surgery, I was thinking about facing it uh, on my own way today. So, um, Let's let's check it out. Let's see. Let's see what they're gonna do to me tomorrow. This is my spine, and uh, we need to fix it. We're gonna use bike me protein cookies because they look like discs. So if this is the disc, this is actually what happened and my disc broke. So what they're gonna do is remove it and fix it. Thank you. 
So this is exactly what they're gonna do to me. Uh, of course, it's gonna look better and it's gonna be uh, titanium. But this will be my <laughs> my fix for tomorrow. Hospital. So it's rehab time. I feel great. Yeah, I'm super happy with my new back. I can say that I'm finally screwed. New beginning. The surgery, the surgery went well. Uh, this is my fused spine, and now it's the rehab time. But before that, let's check if I'm any taller. Okay. Ah, it looks like I'm a bit taller now. It's been exactly one week from spine surgery. They did the fusion and they did an amazing job. The staff was amazing. Surgery was, uh, I think the surgery lasted two hours, two and a half hours. I actually woke up in the middle of the surgery. I tried to scream, my voice, it it didn't it didn't go out at all i was i was completely paralyzed i couldn't move my hands i couldn't tell them that i'm awake my brain started to think okay how can i let them know that i'm that i'm awake i can remember that i felt my heart start pulsing like more and more i was connected to all those devices so i was sure like okay <clears throat> they're gonna see they're gonna see my heartbeats go up and somebody's gonna uh, notice it and, and put me back to sleep. When I woke up, I was shaking because uh, <coughs> that's usually how your body responds after uh, such a big uh, uh, surgery. Now I feel like I'm, I'm really becoming my old, actually new me that's looking forward for some new adventures 
but before those adventures i need to i need to be um i need to be calm and patient because for next six months i need to let the bones fuse together because now they are connected with titanium rods after that it's showtime i guess everything from now on will be different and will be better i might even go back to to biking but not on, on that that crazy extreme level of doing crazy tricks but every trick now every now and then i think it could be it would be easy for me Hopefully this is the last time I'm in the hospital.